Over the last few years, many Android applications have begun to include options that will let you choose if you want to view that app in either a light mode or a dark mode theme. This is really handy for those who use apps at night, or maybe you just want to save a little bit of battery life on devices that use an OLED screen. However, we have yet to see this new option added to the majority of the websites out there. So to help web developers and the folks who use Chrome for Android, I want to show you a hidden feature that will let you force a website to be rendered in a dark mode theme rather than the default light mode theme that most websites use these days. So we can find this feature by first opening up the Chrome application and then visiting the experiments page. We can do that by typing in chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags. And when we go there, we're going to be greeted with this screen and we can go ahead and filter using the word darken to find the option that we're looking for. Now this option is set to default for everyone, but we can manually go in and change this to enabled. And like we always do when changing a setting here, we're going to go ahead and tap that blue relaunch button that appears right there. So now with that option enabled, we need to do one of two things. We either need to enable dark theme or dark mode on a system wide basis, which can be done either in the quick settings panel or in the settings application. Or we're going to go into the settings area of the Chrome application itself, tap the theme option, change this setting to dark, and then put the check marks to apply dark theme to sites when possible. Now, even when we have that option set, it's not going to render all websites in a dark mode theme. Instead, we need to tap the three dot menu and we are given this dark theme checkbox. Now, if we do not have dark mode enabled on a system wide basis, or if the themes setting in Chrome is not set to dark mode, then you're not going to see this dark theme option. So be aware of that. However, with all of this set up, we can then manually trigger any website to be rendered in a dark theme through that three dot menu through this checkbox. So I'm going to use my new website as an example right here. PlayStoreFinder.com has not yet implemented a dark mode option on the website. However, thanks to this experimental feature in Chrome, we can force the website to render as if it had a dark mode option. Now, since this is an experimental feature, some things may not look or render properly. You can see here the logo is not transparent. We have a background on the logo that has been filled in. So whenever Chrome changes this to a dark theme, even though the rest of the website looks like it should in a dark mode theme, the logo here at the top does not look right. So you may get some inconsistencies when using this feature. However, for many, this will be more than worth it since you can now vi view any website in a dark theme. And we can always come in and change this back to how it was just by reverting that dark theme option. I have loaded up GitHub to give you another example of how this change looks. So you can see this is how, this is the default theme of GitHub, just a sample changelog page. 
However, again, we can go in and set this page to a dark theme so that it renders it in a dark mode. And this carries over to other pages in that website as well. Just remember that this is an experimental feature. It's not going to play well with every website out there. You can see in this example, it's not going to change the red background to a black one. It's mainly going to look for things with a white background and change it to a black or dark background. So if you are tired of waiting for a website to add a dark mode option, then check out the experimental Chrome feature that I showed you here today, as that can help bridge the gap for websites that do not have the resources to implement such a feature.